Hi guys! Today I am going to be sharing with you my everyday makeup routine. So I will be sharing the products that I use, how I use them. All of the links for the products that I talk about today will be below in the caption, so if you want to check any of them out, feel free to click down there. Makeup time! First thing I use every day on my eyes is the Mary Kay Eye Primer. I love this eye primer. It does keep your eye makeup on all day long. I just always do a little bit on my finger, rub it together, and then put it all over the lid. So for eye color, I have used the Naked 2 palette for probably two, two years now. So I will walk you through the different colors that I use and how I use them. So to begin with, um, for all over the lid, again from eyelash to eyebrow, I want something light there just to highlight my eyes. So I use a mix, and you'll notice I mix these a lot, Booty Call and Verve. So what I'm gonna do is I'll just, <laughs> whatever I can get out of these, is I will kind of mix the two, and then, again, I just put it all over. So once the base is done, I always like to do something on the brow bone just to accentuate that a little bit. So what I will do is I take chopper and then I do a little bit of snake bite, um, which is more of a brown. And then right on the bone area, I just take it and apply. So the last thing that I do is in the outer corner, I will use blackout which of course if you can see is the darkest it's black just take a little bit of blackout and i apply it right in the outer corner and i'll kind of go in the crease and for me i just feel like it always kind of makes my eyes pop a little more and stand out i'll do the other one so again just outer area get into the little crease you can see, so it does kind of look a little odd, probably with my eyes shut, but you can see out to the outer corner. Okay, so once I have that done, what I do, I just take a Q-tip, just to kind of blend it. Um, I will, well, a, I try to get off any excess black that I might not want. Um, so I just kind of go along, and then I will take the smaller part of the brush and I go back to my original booty call and verve mixture and I will just kind of go on the inside and come over just to blend it a little bit more. I think we're good there. Then next up is my favorite, favorite, favorite. <laughs> say that three times fast eyeliner it is Mary Kay I've used it for 15 years I love it because so first of all it is a retractable pencil so it does self sharpen as you need to use it but what I really love is it just goes on super easy kind of just glides on and it really does stay all day from what I've noticed so for me um, personally I just always line underneath Sometimes, if I'm feeling really crazy, I'll do a little bit at the top, but that very rarely happens. So, for the my eyeliner, I just start from the outer corner and go, and I have like an outside on my eyelid. Some people do in. I don't know how to do that. And I can't, I can't shut my mouth while putting eyeliner on. I'm a bird. right in this outer corner do a little bit and this is the deep brown color if I haven't mentioned that yet so once that is on there I will take my q-tip and just kind of clean it up a little bit last thing for eyeliner what I always like to do is Set it with eyeshadow and that has made such a difference too and I think how long it stays on all day it just doesn't budge so I take the booty call the black and I simply just line and so after I do that I will just take my brush again and kind of blend out if there was any extra that 
everything to go on those corners, okay? Then, once I've set the, the actual liner, I like to brighten my eyes on the inside corners. Go back to those light colors, so the booty call and verb, the inside corner. You can see this to brighten up. So if you have any little bald spots in your eyebrows, I, I don't even know if they make this anymore, but this is the Urban Decay Brow Box. It was Gwen Stefani's collaboration with them, and it's Beach Water Blonde. So I just take this, and it's simply just to fill in some of the bare spots Ooh. to make my eyebrows maybe a little fuller. Last thing for eyes, we're almost there. It's a process. Um, I always curl my eyelashes, so curl those babies. I usually do like two to three times. Okay, so once they're curled, it's mascara time, which mascara is my favorite part of my makeup routine because it's when I actually feel like a human again. Um, oops, sorry, so I use, it's like $5, CoverGirl Super Thick Lash. You can get it at like any drugstore or Target. Um, but again, it's like $5, but I've just had really good success with it. First, I'll do the outside on both. Then what I do after I've done a little bit on the outside, um, the biggest difference that I've noticed for my eyelashes is when I do them on the inside, or I don't know what you'd call that. So I will take it and do the back, and I just roll my brush forward. But this really helps make them a lot thicker, I feel like. And then I am a huge like bottom lash mascara person. So for this, I'll typically look down and just swipe away. So I will take a Q-tip and just anywhere that I see that looks a little like off or maybe some shadow fell or a liner got in places that it shouldn't, I'll take and just clean up a little bit. So I think I need to do the little inside of my eyes because I think there's mascara there. And anywhere else you see. So that is done. Last thing, I just simply always apply a coat of lip gloss and then I'm out the door. Um, this lip gloss I love. It's super nourishing. It's not sticky. It stays on me for a while. So this is Beauty Counters lip gloss. This color is Peony. Um, so I'm a pretty basic lip girl. I'm not super dramatic. Uh, so I'll just apply this is just a pink. And call it a day. Alright, so once my lip gloss is applied, I am done. Hallelujah. So I'm um, ready to take off for the day, but that is my everyday makeup routine. Hopefully it was helpful. Um, if you have any questions on anything you saw or any recommendations you have on ways I could apply my makeup better, um, feel free to leave them in the comments below and I will get check those out or answer any questions you may have. Thank you for watching. Happy beautifying your face.